Okay, next up for the Vineyard Collection, meet this cutie, the Sonoma Relaxed Top. She's wardrobe perfection. Again, I feel like this collection is full of capsule pieces in the sense that they're easy and super versatile, but also they all feel really special and detailed and the Sonoma is no different. You're gonna obsess over this fabric. So the Sonoma is an ivory chambray stripe. Oops, I have a little fuzzy on me. Ivory chambray stripe and it's in 100% cotton, like a double gauze weave and it's, oopsie, stepped on a mirror. It's to die for, so breathable, so lightweight. I am not wearing a cami on underneath this and I, I don't feel like I need one. I don't, I'm just wearing a nude bra. I feel really good to go. So the Sonoma you're gonna be styling just like this for casual, everyday, kind of spring, beachy, travel wear. Look, you can also wear the Sonoma as a cover-up over your bathing suit, as a toss-on while you're at the lake or the beach, a little layer if you're going hiking in the mountains, or just a comfy little throw-on when you wanna look put together and you're staying at home for the day. I feel like a button-up is key. That's just my feelings, I know, but my personal preference, if I wanna feel put together but still really, really comfortable and casual, a button-up is like just a relaxed fit, kind of oversized button-up. It's my go-to. So I love them and I love, love, love the Sonoma. I love that it's lightweight, easy, and breezy, and it's gonna be so versatile. I will untuck it in a second and show you just how long it is so you can have an expectation. If, excuse me. If you want to wear it as a beach cover-up or something like that, but super cute. You could also tuck it in all the way and kind of really elevate it just like that with some different shoes on other than some relaxed sandals. So no stretch in this fabric you're going to see throughout the try -on. This is the easiest fit, so no worries about that. Starting at the top, uh, Starting at the taller, starting at the top, you've got a cute little collared neckline. It's kind of hanging back on me. Of course, you could adjust it forward. Um, uh, functioning buttons, y'all, it's like the Monday after spring break when I'm recording this and my, I don't feel like my brain's all there. Uh, functioning buttons all the way down. I went ahead and unbuttoned one in order to give you this little asymmetrical tuck. I have the top two buttons unbuttoned. You could totally just leave the top button unbuttoned, especially if you wanted to like dress it up a little bit more for work or something, make it look not quite as casual. Then you've got this pocket on the left side, dropped shoulder, seam detailing across the shoulders. There's not a pleat in the back, but there is one of those like cute little loops, you know, like you would hang your, your little shirt. Okay, then going down, like I said, dropped, dropped sleeve, Drop shoulder relaxed sleeve and it has this swift tabbed tab to hold your sleeve up. Over here, I went ahead and undid it where you could see just how long this sleeve is in case you're still in cooler weather. Maybe you wanna wear this, style it under a pullover and you want the sleeve to be able to go down. This gives you an idea of how generous this sleeve length is. Okay, and you can see that it's a really relaxed fit around my body. So untucking it shows you that it's got a high low hemline it's not super drastic but there is a difference in the front and the back and you've got this slit detailing on the side again another reason that i think this is such a fun little cover-up whether you wear it just as a cover-up over your swimsuit or whether you put it on with some little shorts this is such an easy God, it's cute even left out like even with some wider legged jeans for a really relaxed just like I said, kind of beachy vibe. So I'm in love with every detail about her. This will be staying in my closet. Cause again, I think button ups are the key to easy styling. <laughs> okay, um, you could also wear her open if you wanted, obviously. So uh, sizing, small, medium and medium large. I'm wearing the small medium, so it is oversized on me. 32D, I've got plenty of room in my chest, 225, 26, plenty of room around my hips and my waist. There you go, and at 5'5", five, five, of course, I've got full front and full back coverage. If you're in between sizes, if you're a true medium, you could totally go with the small medium or you could size up and get a really oversized fit. So wear it, girl, wear it and love it.